is stinky. Ewy. <laughs> no, no, guys, I'm not stinky. Yes, you are. No, it's not me, it's Steve. He's stinky. He is? Yeah, Steve is stinky. Let's all call him Stinky Steve for the rest of his life. Stinky, stinky Steve, stinky Steve. Stinky Steve. <laughs> Here's your Christmas present, babe. Thank you, boy, for number one. Baby, here, I got you a Christmas present. And thank you, boy, for number two. Um, do you have two boyfriends? Yes. You can't have two boyfriends. That's cheating. What? Is it like the law or something? Hi, Jakey. Sup? Yo, Brittany, you look so beautiful today. <laughs> Did you just cut my hair? Oops. I thought I was holding a hairbrush. <laughs> hey, Brianna, we are putting a group project together. You need to help with the... Oops. Looks like you dropped your book, Stinky Steve. Go fetch. I'm so glad you're getting eliminated this year. Eliminated? This year, anyone who's not on the nice list by Christmas will be eliminated. What do you mean that everyone who's not on the nice list is going to be eliminated? Why would they do that? For population control and to get rid of all the mean people in the world, like you. Stinky Steve, don't walk away. I'm talking to you. What is it, Brianna? What can I do to get on the nice list? Stop being so rude, do good deeds, be kind, apologize to those you hurt, like me. Like you? I'm so sorry for whatever I did to you, you stinky, stinky Steve. It doesn't work. My nice percentage hasn't gone up at all. Because it's not genuine. You don't mean it. You don't even know what you did, do you? What did I do? You're the one who gave me the name Stinky Steve. Because of you, everyone calls me that. I don't have any friends and I can't get a girlfriend because everyone thinks I'm stinky. One year I almost failed all my classes because I stopped showing up at school. I couldn't bear being called Stinky Steve all day long. Steve, I really am sorry. It's too late to apologize. Here's your dinner, Miss Applewood. Susan, what is this? It's your pureed meal. No, no, get me chicken nuggets. You can't have chicken nuggets. You can't chew them. This looks like what was in my diaper this morning, Susan. And this? It's pureed tofu. It's doo-doo. I want chicken nuggets. No. Susan, I want chicken nuggets. You're not getting chicken nuggets. Thank you for the roses. Thank you for the roses. Mmm, ice cream. Miss Applewood, we have a new resident on our floor. Susan, I am working! You're 103 years old. You don't work anymore, Miss Applewood. I really want you to meet this new resident. You'll really like him. I don't want to meet him. Tell him to leave. He lives here. He can't leave. I really think you should try making friends, Miss Applewood. Fine! Hi, I'm Mr. Stevens. Hi, I'm Miss Apple. What? Susan, I'm in love. You have a husband. Mama, I'm in love. What is she doing? With the this is how she flirts. Miss Applewood, I left you some markers and some paper so you can color. I have to go get some work done, so just call me if you need any help, okay? Okay, thank you, Susan. I will. Help! Help me! Help! Miss Applewood, what happened? Susan, I was lonely. Look, everyone, this poor old lady is eating lunch all by herself. Are you recording me, Jennifer? Old age is so beautiful. Who are you calling? Ah! Oh, get over here, Grandma! Is everyone no? To me? Good morning. It's time to take your medicine. Bombastic side eye. No, Miss Applewood. There'll be no side eyeing today. Now take your medicine. You really thought you ate that? No, I don't. But you need to eat your medicine. No, I don't want my medication. I want girl dinner. After you take your medicine. Girl dinner. No, please don't start singing again. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. All right, unplug your life support. Miss Applewood, you soiled yourself. Come on, let's go and get you cleaned up. No, I'm in my pooping my pants era. What happened to your clean girl era? Let's bring that back. Clean girl aesthetic. Exactly. Now let's go get washed up. You're giving me the ick. You're giving me the ick because you smell so bad. Where'd you get that? What are you eating? My husband. Today, we will be making our last girl dinner. Miss Applewood, are you on your phone again? Your grandchildren don't want you to have too much screen time. Mind your business, Susan! What is our dessert? Moldy muffins. Yes, that's my favorite food. I need my glasses. Cake? No, no, no. Too sweet, too sweet. Need some mold on it. Pizza? No, no. Too cheese. Too much cheese! No! Yes. Yes.
toenail clippings. What's my drink? Wash it all down with the Seven Up. Good. Girl dinner. Girl dinner. Hummus. Delectable. Red olives. All right. No, 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 no. I'm not taking my vitamins. Miss Applewood, you need to take your vitamins. No, I told you I'm not taking my vitamins, Susan. <sighs> See, this is why I told you to stop yelling so much. I don't yell. Anyways, scrum nilly umptious. Miss Applewood, your grandchildren are here to see you. Tell them to go home, I'm busy. You're not busy. I'm trying to see what kind of dog I am! Today I will be seeing who has a crush on me. Six, five, ha! I would climb that like a tree. Miss Applewood, what did you just say? No one's talking to you, Susan. Bartender, I don't know because I'm a material girl. He doesn't make that much money. Cancer, oh, he's a 10 out of 10 in looks. <laughs> no one would ever have a crush on you, Miss Applewood, because you're not a very nice lady. That's not true, Susan. I have a husband. Now, what is this filter? I'm a fan. Hmm. Ah! Susan! Susan! Why are you spinning? I don't know, but make it stop! Mrs. Applewood lived a long life, but unfortunately, one dreadful day she turned into a fan, and she couldn't stop spinning. Not even Susan could he be her. Give me now! Bombastic side eye. Girl dinner. Girl dinner slay. It's worse than I thought, Doctor. Her dementia is progressing fast. All she can remember is internet sayings from back in her day. My name is Jeff. It's not looking good, Susan. Let me ask her some basic questions. What's 9 plus 10? 21. This isn't good. She doesn't even know basic math. Miss Applewood, do you remember me? What's my name? Who am I? You're a pain in my ass. I'm bad like the Barbie. Susan, play Barbie World. Nurse Susan's not on this floor anymore. Who are you? I'm Nurse Jennifer. I'll be taking care of you from now on. No, 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 no. Get Susan. Get Susan. I don't want you. I want Susan. Susan doesn't want to see you. Now take your heart medicine and vitamins. I don't take my medicine. And Susan knows that. And she knows I don't take my vitamins. I want Susan here. If you were nice to Susan, she wouldn't have requested to change floors. <sighs> Whatever. I'll go get her myself. Miss Applewood, no. Hey, stop running. Nerdy dad. Oh, do you enjoy, man? Miss Applewood, it's time to take your heart medicine. Susan, you came back for me. I had no choice, Miss Applewood. Nurse Jennifer quit because you hit her with a tray. Good times. That wasn't very nice. Now take your heart medicine. No, 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 no. I don't take my heart medicine, and you know that. If you don't take it, you could have a heart attack. I don't have heart attacks. <gasps> oh, no. <gasps> Miss Applewood. <laughs> That's not funny. That's not something you should joke about, Miss Applewood. <sighs> <gasps> not again. Susan! Susan! I'm not falling for it. If you want mine, I give this to- Miss Applewood! Ah! The other residents are trying to sleep. Susan, I was performing! I told you, no performances after 8 p.m. You should be resting anyways. You just had a heart attack. I don't have heart attack, Susan! I told you! Did you unplug your oxygen? You need it. Your oxygen levels are so low. I don't need oxygen, Susan. Not when you're around. Treat me like YG, don't get me dirty That's it, I'm resigning <gasps> I can't breathe, I can't breathe, Susan! Game leader, Brianna Everyone, I'm in charge of do as I say, not as I do Now remember, you have to copy what I say, not follow my actions Because my actions won't match what I say to do Stop talking, everyone knows the rules already Okay, everyone clap your hands Timmy, what are you doing? No, Timmy, you were supposed to clap your hands. I thought you said clap without hands. <laughs> My brother. Give an instruction. Everyone, cross your arms. Dang it. <laughs> Brittany was copying your dance moves. <laughs> no, Brittany. You were supposed to do as I say, not as I do. I forgot. <laughs> Brittany. Look what you've done, Brianna. I lost my girlfriend and my brother because of you. Jimmy, it's not my fault. They're supposed to do as I say, not as I do. They didn't follow the instructions properly. Maybe if you talked louder, they could have heard the instructions properly. Why is it changing who's in charge? Ha! It's me. Brianna, can I hold your hand? Uh, that's a little weird, Jimmy, because we're not married yet, but okay. <laughs> Timmy, what the flip with that? 
You got shocked when you touched Timmy because he isn't your soulmate. When you touch someone who's not your soulmate, you get shocked. But if you touch your soulmate, magical sparks will fly. You're not my soulmate, Timmy. Get away from me. And you're stinky. But I love you. My love. Babe. Ouch, 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 ouch. ouch. Babe, could I kiss you? Uh, yeah. Ow. That wasn't too bad. Babe. I can't do this anymore. You're not my soulmate, and I don't see sparks when I touch you. I just keep getting shocked, and it really hurts. Who cares if we're not soulmates? I love you. I love you too, but I can't be with you. <laughs> oh no, I really gotta get out of here. Hey, hey, wait. Oh no, I really gotta get out of here. Hey. Hey, wait! Stop running from me! You're my soulmate! I'm really out of shape. Brianna, is everything okay? My soulmate just ran away from me. Maybe I've seen him. What does he look like? He had on a black ski mask, so I couldn't see his face. And he was carrying a giant bag over his shoulder. Oh, and he was running away from me. He sounds like such a weirdo. Hey, baby. Hi, Jakey. I missed you so much. Jake, Brittany, why are you two holding hands? Because we're soulmates. When I was walking in the hallway, I noticed that Brittany dropped her book. I went to help her pick it up, and we accidentally touched hands, and magical sparks flew. Isn't it great? My ex and my best friends are soulmates. Great. It's not like we just broke up or anything. Bree, are you upset? No, no, it's really, it's great. It's great. Great. Class, has anyone seen a guy wearing a ski mask, carrying a bag over his shoulder? Yes, I saw him. That's my soul. Great, because the police are looking for him. I mean, would you rather kiss Brianna or kiss a frog? <laughs> Timmy, you just got chosen to play Would You Rather? Choose carefully because whatever you choose, you have to do it or else you die. Okay, I would rather kiss Brianna. Brianna, come here. No, you, Timmy, you're stinky. Brianna, kiss me. No, I have to do it or else I... You should have did your Would You Rather. You should have did your Would You Rather. Have a good day at school, sweetie. Thanks, Grandma. Love you. Would you rather smell your grandma's socks or smell your grandma's dentures? I'll go with socks. Here you go, sweetie. I've had these socks on for 12 months. What? Hurry up and smell them. Okay. What happened? You fainted for 30 minutes. Oh, no. I'm so late for school. Babe, you made it. You were like an hour late. I was getting worried about you. I thought you weren't going to come today. Head and shoulders, knees and toes. I can't touch my toes. I can't read. <laughs> Timmy can't touch his toes. <laughs> <laughs> you must do whatever the song says or you die. Head and... Everyone pay attention. The head and shoulders song is playing. Shoulders spin around. Spin around. Oh no, I'm becoming so dizzy. Spin around. Oh no, I'm getting too dizzy. I can't do it. I can't spin anymore. I'm going to fall over. Eugene, you have to spin or she'll kill you. Can I spin on the floor? <laughs> Eugene. Head and... Did you just get the head and shoulder song? You don't hear it? No, that means you're getting a personal instruction. Would you rather kiss Brianna or kiss a frog? <laughs> Timmy, you just got chosen to play Would You Rather? Choose carefully, because whatever you choose, you have to do it or else you die. Okay, I would rather kiss Brianna. Brianna, come here. No, you, Timmy, you're stinky. Brianna, kiss me. No, I have to do it or else I... You should have did your Would You Rather. You should have did your Would You Rather. Have a good day at school, sweetie. Thanks, Grandma. Love you. Would you rather smell your grandma's socks or smell your grandma's dentures? I'll go with socks. Here you go, sweetie. I've had these socks on for 12 months. What? Hurry up and smell them. Okay. What happened? You fainted for 30 minutes. Oh, no, I'm so late for school. Babe, you made it. You were like an hour late. I was getting worried about you. I thought you weren't going to come today. A potato, pass it on! I don't want this potato, it's ugly! You have to pass it on before the timer runs out or else you die! <gasps> Hello, little girl! Here, random guy, have a potato! Thank you, I am so hungry! 
Hot potato pass it on! Seriously, Derek! Where is everyone? Sophie! Hot potato pass it on! Why would you give me the potato? I'm your best friend! Timmy, hot potato pass it on! Are you kidding me right now? I'm glad you're safe, Sophie. Yeah, no thanks to you. How could you pass me the potato? I thought we were best friends. I was scared. I couldn't find anyone else to pass it to. We're not best friends anymore. Don't talk to me ever again. Sophie, don't do this. Goodbye. Sophie! Oh, no. Oh, no. <gasps> Everyone run! She has the potato! Come on, guys! Jimmy, hot potato, pass it on! Oh! Woo, 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 I'm gonna drop it! No, Jimmy, if you drop the potato after touching it, you die! I dropped it! Come on, Jimmy! Hey, Sophie, wait. Are you really just never going to speak to me again? Hot potato, pass it on. Hot potato, pass it on! Hot potato, pass it on! No, you pass it on! No, you! No, you! Pass on the potato! Hot potato, pass it on! Pass on the hot potato! Pass it on, Sophie! Pass it on! Ouch! This assignment's so hard. Could you help me, Brianna? <laughs> Anything for you, Jake. Oh, mother f Day of the week is it? I forgot. <gasps> Oh no, Jimmy, you forgot. You need to remember before the timer runs out or else you die. I don't know. It could be any day of the week. It could be Monday, Tuesday, Friday. Come on, Jimmy, think. Come on, Jimmy. It's a day of the week that starts with the T. Oh, it starts with the T. Timmy? No, Jimmy, that's not a day of the week. Jimmy, no! The answer was Thursday. Wait. What did I just come in this room for? Oh no, I forgot. Are you off to school now, sweetie? <gasps> My school bag. That's what I forgot. All right, mom, I'm off to school now. You never said goodbye to me. Uh, uh, what's your name again? Grandma, you forgot? Grandma's getting old. She's becoming more forgetful. It starts with a B. Buddy. What? No, it rhymes with banana. Uh, it rhymes with banana. Uh, nana. Banana for fana, banana, banana. I don't know what else rhymes with banana. Grandma! Don't blame yourself. Grandma's memory has been getting bad for a while now. It's because of her old age. I'm leaving now. Bye, Mom. Aren't you forgetting something? What could I possibly be forgetting? Oh, my lunch. Jenny, your outfit looks so good. What's the occasion? Seriously, you forgot? No, I remember you're going to a funeral. No, you're my best friend. How could you forget? It's your birthday. Happy birthday, Jenny. I can't believe you. Jenny. Psst, Jenny. Jenny. Please forgive me. I'm sorry I forgot your birthday. Hey, Brianna, when Jimmy died, what day of the week was it? How could I remember that, Timmy? I was six. Hey, Brianna, when Jimmy died, what day of the week was it? How could I remember that, Timmy? I was six. <laughs> Come on, Brianna, think. The answer was Thursday. Thursday, Thursday, it was Thursday! Dang it! Timmy, why did you ask me that question knowing I wouldn't be able to remember? The day that Jimmy forgot, you had no remorse for him. Ever since then, I knew I had to get revenge. Timmy, what's the last thing you said to Jimmy? Oh, uh, oh, uh, I don't remember! I'm lying. It was Jimmy no! From now on, Brianna, watch your back. I forgive you for forgetting my birthday. Really? No. What color shirt was I wearing yesterday? <laughs> Good job, Jenny. You guys are trying to get me out together. Your shirt was pink. You're right. It was pink. Hey, Jenny. When's my birthday? Your birthday was, um... Hey, Jenny. When's my birthday? Your birthday was, um... January? You got mad at me because I forgot your birthday. And even teamed up with Timmy to try and eliminate me. Leave me out of this. Brianna, I really am sorry. You've been a great friend. Come on, Jenny. You can remember. We've been friends since kindergarten. I, I can't. I just, I don't remember. No. <laughs> Jenny. Jenny. Well, this is awkward. <laughs> Jimmy. Mommy. This is all your fault, Timmy. You're the one who turned Jenny against me. Mom, can you come pick me up? What day of the week is it? Sunday. What did you eat for dinner last night? Raw onions. What's the last thing Jimmy said before he died? Oh, it starts with a T. Timmy. 
Brianna, are you trying to ask too many questions you know he'd forget? No, uh, um, uh, it's not what it looks like. Did you forget my name? No, I remember your name, it's- I'm in love with you, Brianna. Did you forget my name? No, I remember your name, it's- I'm in love with you, Brianna. Of course, everyone forgets the nerdy guy's name. Eugene! I remember now, you're the nerdy guy who has no riz and gets no girls. That's enough, Brianna! Timmy, why did you say you're in love with me earlier? Because I am. I think that's the real reason I was so mad. What color shirt was I wearing yesterday? Blue. What did Eugene say to you after you remembered his name? That's enough, Brianna! I know you don't actually love me, Timmy. You were just trying to catch me off guard so I'd lose. Hey, Brianna. Jimmy, how are you alive? I took Jimmy to the hospital that night, and he survived. Jimmy's been in hiding ever since, because if the government found out, they'd eliminate him for real this time. Jimmy and Timmy, that night that Jimmy was so-called eliminated, what did I say before I walked off? That's a trick question. You didn't say anything. You just walked off. Yeah, she just walked off. That's correct. Why is the timer still going? No way. Is it not correct? I don't think so, Timmy. What she said was, it was Thursday. Oh, right. I remember now. You said it was Thursday. That's not the answer. If that's not the answer, what is? The answer was Thursday. It's your turn to play a game of truth or lie. Yay! Mommy, they said it's my turn to play a game. I love games so much. Sweetie, truth or lie is very dangerous. They'll give you a statement about someone you know, and you must say if it's a truth or a lie. And if you guess it wrong, you die. <laughs> Brianna, truth or lie? Your dad is coming back with the milk. Your dad is coming back with the milk. I think that is the truth because daddy said he would come back with the milk, so he must be coming back with the milk, right? Sweetie, I can't tell you the answer, but dad went to go get milk over a year ago now. Daddy's not coming back with the milk, is he? That's for you to decide. It was a lie. Bree! Sophie, hey! Truth or lie? Sophie makes fun of you for not having a dad behind your back. I just got a truth or lie. Sophie makes fun of you for not having a dad behind your back? You would never do that, right? Come on, Brianna, you know me. You can guess this right. Hey, Brianna, has your dad came home with the milk yet? <laughs> Continue being a doll or become a human. I've always wanted to be a human. Oh, honey, you're awake. I just started making breakfast. Here, you should have something to drink. You must be thirsty. Refreshing, thank you. Um, darling, the water's actually supposed to go in your mouth. Sorry, it's my first day being a human. Brianna, there you are. Brianna? What's a Brianna? Um, you, that's your name. Well, I used to be a doll. Babe, I've missed you so much. Come here. Why would you do that? Because we're boyfriend and girlfriend. That's what we do. Hey, are you actually a doll or were you a doll? Mm -hmm. Yes. Then that means you've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Please, please, listen to me. I am not a doll. I am a human, trapped inside a doll. This doll's so advanced, you programmed her. I wasn't programmed. I'm human. I need to get out of here. <sighs> <laughs> You're not going to get very far with plastic legs. This doll's kind of weird. Do you think any kids will buy a human trapped in a doll doll? I don't think so, boss. That's not very popular amongst kids. I told you, I am not a doll. Yeah, I don't think she'll sell. If no one buys her by the end of the day, we'll throw her in the garbage. Wow, I want this doll. She looks so realistic. Little girl, I am not a doll. I am a human. You've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Do you know where you used to live when you were a doll? That must be where the real Brianna is. I used to live in a room with lots of other dolls where little kids would come and stare at us. Oh, a toy store. Babe, you look so beautiful today. <laughs> Stop it, Jake. That's not the real Brianna. Okay, but it still looks like her. Why does my face feel so warm? Because you're blushing. Now, come on. We have to find out which toy store you're from. You were Brianna's best friend? Not were. I am Brianna's best friend. I've never had a friend before. My eyes are feeling wet. That's because you're about to cry. Cry? Okay, this is a toy store. Do you recognize it? 
Yes, this used to be my home. I want to leave. Hello, ladies. Could I help you find anything? Why does your friend look so scared? She's just like that. Do you have a doll that's like super realistic? Kind of seems like a human. Yeah, a little girl just stole her. Thank you for saying that to me. It really helped me understand. I'm sorry. I want to buy you, but I don't have any money. You don't need any money. You just need to carry me and run. You're pretty heavy. Thank you for getting me out of there. Now I'll show you where the best place to find me is. My high school. Okay, you show me the way and I'll carry you. Wait, before we go, I must ask. Won't your parents be worried about you? My parents won't be worried about me because I don't have any parents. I'm an orphan. I don't have any friends either. That's why I wanted a doll so bad, so I could have someone to play with and keep me company. I'll make you a deal. Once you get me back in my human body, I'll buy you as many dolls as you would like. Who are you looking at? My best friend Stephanie! And me! What are we going to do now? A little girl stole the real Brianna. Hey, look over there. That's me. Come on, hurry. Let's catch up to them. Brianna, wait. Stephanie and me. Me when I was a doll. We found the real Brianna, but how are we going to get your body switched back? I have an option to go back as a doll, but I'm sorry. I can't do it. I don't want to go back to that toy store and that bad man. No, you have to give Brianna's body back. You're a doll, and she's a human. You can't steal her body. I have an idea. If you choose to go back as a doll, you can come back with me and be my doll. We'll be best friends. A friend? I've never had a friend before. Okay. I'll choose it. I'm back in my body. I'm back as a doll. Stephanie, I've missed you so much. I'm so excited to bring you home with me. Yes, you and I are going to have so much fun. <laughs> Yay!